Well, thanks for calling into the pre-show, Greg. Thank you. How was your day? Um, the Prime Minister mm -hmm. mentioned the group ConquerCOVID19.ca that yep. I'm helping in terms of managing the website. And yeah. uh, I laughed and I cried because I've now called my hosting company four times in the past week to talk about the plan I'm on and how do I have to up it. It started, it started with a CTV article on Sunday. Then I believe it was the Minister of Family Services retweeted the CTV article yesterday. And then the yeah. Prime Minister walks out today and mentions the group. And they're like, okay, okay. You know, we, we launched a website, spun it up, thought it would uh, put a couple of forms on there. You know, we thought we'd get some inquiries uh, over the last day. We've had hundreds and hundreds of inquiries. We've had to engage uh, U of T med students to help us out, field all the inquiries. It's been nuts. Really? Yep. Wow. Okay. I did not know that. Yep. Yeah. It's been that fantastic. Is... The response has been phenomenal and so many people want to help and so many people want to, so many people need help. But what's uh -huh. amazing is so many people want to help and it's people saying, I've got time, I've got technology, I've got, you know, masks that I have in my house, got uh, tons of things. That's awesome. Good, good, good. And are you fine? Like, are you getting stuff to doctors and hospitals and nurses? Yeah. And so other so one of the, one, facilities? Yeah, yeah. One of the, uh, one of the. An example of that that's that's been amazing is we had one of the doctors, one of the physicians on in our group because we have a number of physicians that sit within our advisor, not advisor group, but within this group. And uh, one of them said, "You know, what would be really great is if we had baby monitors, so that you know doctors that are in with the patients but are consulting with other doctors can talk mm -hmm. via two-way communications with baby monitors, for example." Mm -hmm. And so um, we put the word out and our good friend Suleiman, I think, reached out to Toys R Us. Toys R Us stepped up and I think they've donated 125 monitors, which are now being distributed to hospitals around the GTA. So a lot, a lot of, mm -hmm. it's really nice to see the brands that are, the brands and the companies that are stepping up. XYZ Storage, um, the company that with Iron Gate that we have our, our sellers with, um, yeah. our vaults. Uh, mm -hmm. they stepped up and, uh, they've offered basically storage across Canada and vehicles across Canada as we need for delivery and pickup. It's been fantastic. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. Yeah. That is good. Well, I mean, it's, everyone's being impacted in some way, shape or form right across this country. Yep. Um, so I think people are sort of saying, okay, it's up to me to do something, whether that something is staying at home. Um, or whether that something is like what you're doing, um, helping out with a, um, you know, with a, with a group of volunteers to, to get product that is needed to the, uh, what people are calling the front lines.